Debbie Birch and I'm with the Queen Anne's County Office of Tourism and we're here today to talk about an upcoming event August 6th, 11th through the 16th. It's the 72nd, yes that's 72nd annual Queen Anne's County Fair and we're doing um, some different segments on different aspects of the fair and events that go on during it and one of the big events is the livestock sale and I have Maggie Corsi here with me today and she's going to tell us about the livestock sale, what goes on because I don't have any idea um, and you know you can come out and watch and what you can see while it's happening. Welcome, thank you for coming. Thank you, thank you for having me. So tell me about this what what's getting sold who well, let's start with who's selling stuff first uh for four hers only queen anne's county four hers get, okay. get the opportunity to sell their project animal that they've worked with all this current year okay and they're the um the four hers so they're what they're eight or nine years old mm -hmm. too they're eight through 18 eight through 18 mm -hmm. okay so there might be little kids there might mm -hmm. be big kids that's correct yeah and then what kind of animals can they sell uh, they're allowed to sell one of two species they can sell beef steers they can sell market hogs, market sheep, market goats, and they also can do a pen of rabbits or a pen of um, oh. poultry, like chickens or ducks, that okay. sort of thing, yes. And I'm just fascinated that they've raised, you know, they've been raising mm -hmm. these. So, and it, it's a live auction. So you have an auction near yes, there? Yes, we have an auctioneer coming from Delaware. Okay. Um, Mr. Sam Walters, we've used him for the past few years. And uh, it is, it's a live auction that you bid and the highest bidder wins. Okay. The animals are usually sold by the pound. That's what I was so, going to ask. Yes, yes. <laughs> Usually they're sold by the pound, except for your smaller animals like the rabbits and chickens and stuff, and those are sold by the pen. Okay. So. And then suppose I come and I decide I'm going to buy a cow to help support a 4 h -er that I know. Do I have to take it? Because I have nowhere to keep no, it. No. <laughs> um, once you purchase the animal, you have a choice. You can, um, you can have, if you want to eat the animal, we transfer or transport to local butchers. Okay. Um, we'll do that for you once the fair ends. We won't okay. do it that night, but once the fair ends. But if you don't want the animal, you can donate it back. Oh, okay. And then what happens is the 4 h gets the money that you spent on the animal, mm -hmm. and then it gets resold at another auction where we'll take it, and then that money gets donated to a charity of your choice. So you're, it's a double... A d yes, a it's a win-win, yes. Wow. Yes, the 4 h okay. still earns their money, and then you can donate that money to a charity. Wow. So. Um, is there anything else else that you know about the auction that we should know or well the auction itself starts at six o'clock okay but registration begins at five okay. um, what you need to do is come to the registration table the auction is at the hog show ring so it's not at the main show ring it's okay. at the hog barn and you come to the registration table you sign up get a registration number and then that's it. So it's one it. of those where you get to hold yep, your numbers you up oh yes, no a real yes, auction uh -huh. <laughs> and then once the, once you win you hold your number up They'll announce who the winner okay. was, and then you'll go and have your picture taken with the 4-H'er. That's what I was going to ask if the kids actually yes. get to bring it up. The kids get to up. shake a hand, yep, say thank you, you get your picture taken, and then that's when you would inform us what you want to happen right. with your animal. Um, then for the following fair, you'll get recognition. We put up signs thanking businesses and people who buy the animals. Oh, nice. And then they also get um, two free dinners for the following oh, year. okay. So, and anyone can buy. I mean, it can be a, just an individual person. It can be organization. It can be a business. It doesn't matter. Okay. And, and does usually everything get sold? Um, last year we sold about 68 animals. Wow. Um, typically, each animal, the children usually get them in winter or spring. You know, mm -hmm. they raise them and take care of them. But at the 4 H shows, the judge has to approve the animal okay. to, to be sold. And each species has different classification requirements that they need. Um, like, for instance, uh, swine has to be a certain weight. Okay, and so, that the, so they just can't say, oh, I'm bringing this animal no, and I'm going to sell it. No, it, it has There's to be approved by the judge. Gotcha. And, um, and then the children, in order to receive their checks from the businesses, have to write a thank you note and we oh. make sure they come to the office and they receive they write their note and show it to us right and then we send give the money and they send the note what a so great project it's for the wonderful, kids yes and it's a good way for businesses to thank families right a lot of times um, it's a family who has worked with that business that the business comes back and supports the right. 4 -H -er. wonderful so, but anyone is eligible and it's tax deductible <sighs> There we go. So yeah, it's a win-win-win. Win yes, it for is. It's everyone. a great opportunity. It's a fun night to come out and watch, even if you're thinking about, you know, purchasing. Right. Something. Well, that's what I'm thinking. The auction yeah. itself. Um, I've seen Sam auction. He yes. at the chicken uh -huh. festival. He did yes. the chickens for us, and he just watching him it's auction yes. is is yeah, a great <laughs> entertainment. Yes. So, is there anything else that you want to tell us, or you know? Um, 
lastly, I will say if you want, if anybody wants more information, they can go to the Queen Anne's mm -hmm. County um, Fair website, which is www.queenannesco4countyfair.com, okay. and um, there's contact information mm -hmm. listed on there. And there's also the full schedule of you know when all the events are going to happen. So. Yes. Yep, Great. that's wonderful. Yeah, I mean, come on out. It's Friday night, 6 o'clock. Like I said, registration's at 5. And um, just check it out. You never know. You might, you know, find something you want to purchase and help a kid out. <laughs> wonderful. Well, thank you, Maggie, thank for you. coming in.